Hello everyone. Today I will explain to you how to create a video playback function through video controls after welding flash on the standard screen. First, let's take a look at the solder nor and NAND flash. This video is divided into three parts. The first part introduced the expanded nor and NAND flash ID storage distribution. Please take a look at this picture. The first 64 bits are the 16 megabytes nor flash that comes with the smart screen itself. And the letters are the weld nor and NAND flash, each of which occupies 64 bits, which will be extended in turn. To the last extended NAND flash occupies the last 192 to 255 positions. When doing the project later, name the file according to the ID distribution location. The second part is to make the project. First, we open the latest software. Click New. Select the resolution and the storage path. Select the background images. Next, generate the background image SL. Select the DYSL generator. Select pictures. Click Generate SL. Save it in the DYSL folder and name it 32. The next important step is to generate SL and WAE fields from the video through the movie tool. Select the video prepared in advance. Pay attention to the frame rate. Then set the video size. Here, I first generate the SL file. Save it in the DualSet folder and name it 192 according to the named ID location. After the generation is complete, generate the WAV file. Click WAE tool. Select the WAV field. First, convert the Hertz to 32000. Then select the data format. Click Generate WAE. Be careful not to conflict with the SL field. Here, I named it 195, which is also placed in the DWSET folder. After the generation is complete, we start to make the control display. Select the video control. Set the VP address. Fill in the frame rate and file name. Next. Make a few controls to control video playback and pause. Select Return Key Code Control. Set the button effect. The key value setting is according to the command. Play the video is 5A03. Pause is 5A02. And stop is 5A01. So here the key value is 5803. The VP address is same as the video control VP address. Copy 1. Change the key value to 5A02. Then copy 1. Change the key value to 5A01. Then click Save and Generate. The third step. Put the latest kernel in the DMSAT folder. Then we need to modify the data in the CFG field. Open the T5L development guide. We need to change the position 6. Because we have extended the NAND flash, so we need to change the position 6 to 1. And format the NAND flash once, such as video manipulation to modify data.
after the modification is completed. Put the CFG file in the Dune Set folder and download it to the screen. Insert the SD card. Power on. When downloading, we can see that if the top row shows red, it proves that the kernel is downloaded successfully. And then it will start to format. After the format is completed, the project will be downloaded. When end is displayed, it proves that the download is end. Power on. We can see that the project has been downloaded successfully. First, click on the touch to control the video playback and stop. Then we come to use command control. Send the play command first. You can see that the video is playing. Pause command and then send the pause command again. The video will be played again. Send the stop command. The video stops playing. Finally, send the play command. Then the video will play. At this time, today's video explanation is end. Thank you for watching.